What's up, man? 25 Gamers. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today's video, we're going to be discussing part two of our six part series on the Arizona shotgun type formation. Um, today's video, we're going to be showcasing a play that we use to beat zone defense primarily, uh, typically against off coverage, but it can be beat. Uh, it can also beat with two men under. It's a very good play in general. Um, and it's a play that we like to use after we've established our zone of posts. Uh, quickly, before we get into that, I want to direct your attention to the uh, annotation as well as the descriptions on the screen. And uh, you can check out part one uh, if you did not be if you were not uh, if you were unable to see part one uh, of our of our guide here. You can check that out. I'll leave a link in the description. I'll also leave a link on the annotation. Also, guys, uh, if you want to check out some of my defensive tips, uh, I got a couple of nice blitzes. You can check that out on the right. Um, and then lastly, if you have any comments, questions, suggestions, uh, or problems related to this video, uh, you can leave them in the comment section. I'll try to get back with you as soon as possible. All right. So that takes care of the business side. Let's hop into the shotgun type formation uh, real quick. I'm going to grab a cover four to show you how this play works. Um, but the shotgun type Arizona seams. I have it in my audibles, but we'll just show it to you coming out in it. Um, so first and foremost against cover four, if they're running the cover four, the only adjustment is to motion that slot receiver across left to right and also to put your running back on an option route. Um, the first read on this play is the crossing route to James Jones. As you see there, uh, it does a pretty decent job uh, at beating the zone. Uh, it's more specifically the, the, the heavy deep zones like cover four, cover three type. Uh, with only two yellow zones over the middle, you can really kind of get this, this route open across, uh, across formation. Another option uh, against the cover four, and, and typically, uh, specifically against cover four, is this seam route to Jordy Nelson over the top. But the pass lead up, it does a very good job at splitting those two deep zones. Um, a quick little note against cover four, some routes I would not throw uh, include this route to Randall Cobb. As you'll see here, uh, against the cover four, it doesn't do as good of a job, and typically will get intercepted if you force it uh, into that triple or four deep coverage. Uh, that route is specifically deserved, reserved for a cover two situation, uh, something like a cover two sink or, or cover two buck. Um, and then lastly, um, this is a route, this, this route to Boykin. When you pass lead it up, you can actually cut that off for a user catch. Um, so if you are uh, user friendly, if, you, you know, if you're good at user catching, then you could try that. But if you're not, then I would recommend uh, going with something else. Um, and then also you could hit the running back if you want to. Uh, cover three now, I want to show you that real quick here. We're going to go through this pretty quickly. Uh, but the cover three is the same kind of thought process, uh, the crossing route. Uh, it's typically going to do a decent job, um, but again, you can actually, if you if you're not if you're not a big fan of crossing routes against cover three, then you can actually hit once again Jordy Nelson's little vertical route uh, does a very good job passing that up, and it does a pretty good pretty nice job of getting into a uh, a nice little uh, vulnerable spot of the cover three. Uh, once again, some stipulations that you don't want to throw against cover three uh, do is, once again, include that route to Randall Cobb. As you see, we have success there, but more than likely you won't have the success. Uh, you definitely will not have success if you fail to pass lead this route. If you do not pass lead this route down into the outside, it will not be open. I'm talking about specifically that deep corner to Randall Cobb, and there you see kind of the, the frustration with throwing it against a cover three shell. Um, and then lastly, I want to quickly note, uh, Boykin's route, once again, can be user catch. It's the uh, it's our user catch route. And uh, against cover three, pass lead down into the inside, and you're going to click on and just cut it off. And you see how that works uh, there. And so if you feel comfortable doing that, you can do that. But once again, I do not advise it for beginners. Um, and then lastly, uh, against a cover three, specifically a cover three, when we put our running back on that option route, uh, it's going to sit in the zone, uh, and that zone is going to be stretched by the streak, and you can see you can just take a short route to Eddie Lacy as well. All right, and so the key here is to identify, once again, the user defender of the opponent and whether he's going to go deep with Jordan Nelson or he's going to sit down with Eddie Lacy. The computer won't cover either of those, though. All right, guys, and then now I want to show you the key to this. Uh, typically, when you're facing guys that run a lot of two men under, uh, they're also going to run a lot of cover two sink this route, uh, and we're going to show you how to beat cover two sink. Uh, because the crossing pattern, uh, it, it will beat cover two sink, but it's just there's a lot more opportunity for hit sticks and, and blah, blah, blah. And it just doesn't it doesn't fit with my uh, general philosophy for wanting to beat cover two sink. I want to destroy cover two sink by taking the verticals. And so that's their, that's where our, our route to Randall Cobb comes in, is it destroys the cover two sink, as you see right there, uh, right over the top uh, on that outside. And, and remember, we like to use a... Um, a pass lead to the down and to the outside so that it gets a nicer uh, corner crisper animation. Um, 
And then our third read is, again, that route to Nelson. This one's not as open uh, because that safety will just come over and lay him out, and that's why we like to take advantage of Randall Cobb's route uh, versus Jordy Nelson's. But you can throw it if you are set on that route. Uh, once again, Boykin's route, pass lead up into the outside in this situation because of the cover two. And you can sometimes slip it in there, but again, once again,